hi guys welcome to my youtube channel in today's video we are going to learn about convert data table to text action in power automate desktop so please watch this video till then so that you can understand it completely and if you have not subscribed my youtube channel yet please subscribe it so let's get started under the variables and under the data table section you will get this convert data table to text action in this case we will pass the data table and then under the advanced section we will have this option to include the column names and then you can use the separator as well so this is the excel file from where we will read this data and then we will try to convert it to text since my excel file is already open i will go to excel and from here i will choose attach to running excel i will choose the file name instance will be stored in the excel instance i will click on save and then from here i will choose read from excel worksheet from the retrieve, I will choose all available values from the worksheet. Under the advanced, I will choose first line of range contains column names and all the data will be stored in the Excel data table variable. I will click on save. After that, I will choose this convert data table to text action. From here, I will choose the data table variable. And under the advanced section, I will choose this separator. I will enable this option. Let's say you want to split the data based on pipe. Then I will click on save. Now I will run the bot. You can see here that the execution has been completed and we have 10 rows here. And here if you see this CSV text variable, you have data which is separated by pipe. Under the advanced, if you do not choose this option, right, and if you keep it disabled, right, in that case, you will get system default, comma, semicolon, and tab, right. So these are the default separator. Let's say I'm using this system default separator. I will click on save and then I will run the bot. Here you notice that now your data is separated by comma. So this is the default separator of the system right if you want to separate the data using the semicolon you can choose semicolon click on save and then run the bot now here you can see that all the data are separated by semicolon once you have this data you can write it as a csv you need to just launch excel and click on save and then you can use this write to excel worksheet action you can choose the instance as excel instance value to write is going to be let's say csv text column is going to be one row is going to be one then click on save then you can use this csv text here you need to choose the instance again and then you can say that save the document as from the document format you can choose csv and then you can give the file path file path is d sample file sample csv data click on save and then i will run the bot execution has been completed and here you can see that you have all the data so this is how you can use convert data table to text action if you like this video please click on the like button and please subscribe my youtube channel and if you have any question, please post it in the comment section. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.